How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Goshen's Games. And if you're like me, you have yourself an external hard drive to be able to play your PS4 games on your PS5 directly, as well as store PS5 games that you've downloaded. Well, I want to show you how to set this up so you can do so. So make sure you guys are hitting that like button, subscribe if you guys are new. Let's go ahead and set this up. All right, so what we want to do here is we want to go to our settings and in our settings we go down to system in the system we want to go down I'm sorry did I say system I meant storage sorry I'm a little tired let's go down to USB extended storage where we see our game drive right there game drive Western digital eight terabytes so we want to format this to use it as USB extended storage so we're gonna go ahead and do that so we can play our games so let's go ahead and do this when you format the usb drive all data will be deleted that is fine we're doing that to make sure we can go ahead and format it formatting don't disconnect the usb drive so i don't know how long this is going to take i will be right back that actually took no time at all uh it's done formatting this usb drive has been formatted as usb extended storage ps games ps4 games and apps will now be installed in usb extended storage to change where ps4 games and apps are installed go to settings storage usb extended storage and turn on or off always install ps4 games to us uh, usb extended storage um so we're going to go ahead and, and install or we're going to transfer uh one of our games to the USB storage. Uh, let's go, I'm gonna, let's do, uh, let's see. Without having to re-download anything, let me go my, to my game library and let's see what's installed as far as like PS4 games go. Um, okay, so we have Persona 5 Strikers. We're gonna go ahead and move this one. So move it to USB extended storage so we can go ahead and test this out here. Move PlayStation 4 content. So we got, we already go, uh, clicked on that one. Um, yeah, move it. Let's see how long this takes. 16 gigs uh, it's supposed to move pretty quickly so we'll find out I mean it, it's going at a decent rate I mean decent enough right but okay I'm gonna pause this I'll be back all right so it's done moving it actually didn't take that long at all it's right there now USB extended storage uh, it took me about Maybe like two minutes to transfer it. So it's two minutes, 16 gig transfer. That's not too bad. Biggest question is, can we now play the game? So I'm going to go ahead and load it up right here. And let's get started. Let's see if it plays directly from the extended storage. And it looks like it is, which that is one of the biggest concerns because the newest update allows you to play PS4 games directly from an external hard drive. So that's why we're checking this and it looks like it's good to go. Uh, yeah. All right. Everything seems to be loading just fine. And at a fairly decent rate, like it's, I, I don't, I don't see any, uh, I don't see any sort of latent or, you know, latency issues. Um, no, it, it's running fine. Okay. That is really, really good. Let's get to work. Oh, I'm, I'm impressed. Okay. So, I guess I can now put all my PS4 games onto this external hard drive. Uh, so, that way I don't have to take up space in my PS5 anymore. So, thank you guys so much for watching the video today. Uh, oh, by the way, before we get out of here. Uh, those of you guys who are probably curious as to what hard drive I'm using. This is the... Uh, Western Digital Black. This is an 8 terabyte hard drive. I will go ahead and have an affiliate link for you guys from Amazon down below. Um, you know, it's it's not a sponsored link, but buying from the affiliate link, if you are going to be buying from, you know, from anyone, it does help the channel out a little bit. Uh, so I'll put the 8 terabyte hard drive that I'm using as well as different uh, variations. So you got the 4 terabyte options and uh, I think it goes 5, 4, 3 uh, as far as the options and and these are really solid uh hard drives to be able to use because i mean the biggest issue or not the biggest issue but the biggest concern is the read speed uh you have to have a certain amount of read speed and it has to uh, i believe it has to have the super speed transfer whatever it was uh that was required from from playstation so yeah i'll go ahead and put an affiliate link down for you guys 
Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys real soon.